Alright, hey, don't be talking smack about these clips in my head either. I'm getting my hair done so I can look good for him. Hey, you gonna hold the door? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you were coming in. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool. It's alright, it's alright. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, he got me messed up. He over here uh, closing the door on me. But, uh, let's walk back here to this truck. What's up, you guys? So, right now we are we are going to pick up our fifth truck. Yeah, fourth truck. Our fourth truck, because we took that rider back. As y'all know, we're going to pick up our fourth truck. And it's uh, brand new, as y'all already know. Brand new 2020 budget box truck. 2022. Oh, yeah. <laughs> My bad, 2022. I'm over here. Uh, I'm thinking ahead of myself, but... Brand new 22 Brax truck, everything in there fully loaded and clean. Um, yeah, we're about to go pick it up. And we're going to show y'all when we pull up what it's looking like. A couple days ago, we just been, we've been seeing that we had emails um, saying that we have a reservation booked. From our rental account manager. Right. Well, what happened, y'all, was our rental account manager had actually, I think he called me. He's like, yo, I got a truck out there right where you at. I was like, oh, okay, I'm actually cool with the local budget that's in this area. So, you know, I'm like, that's that's perfect because I rent my regular cars through this lady. So he was like, yeah, 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 go check it out. Um, see if you like it. I'm like, he didn't tell me the year. He didn't tell me nothing about the truck. He just, he, the only thing I remember him telling me was that it didn't have a lift gate. He said it, he thought it was only uh a uh, rent. So I thought about it, and I was like, nah, I just never called. I, I never really, you know, went after it. Then he sent me, you know, a day went by. I think he, I seen the emails going back and forth because they, they attached me in the emails with the district manager and stuff like that when they go back and forth trying to make the reservation. I still didn't intervene. And then a, a couple days ago, maybe a few days ago, maybe like the day before yesterday to be exact, I saw that they sent an email and he was like, he, he, it was directed towards me. He said, hey, are you going to go get that truck? I wrote back. I said, you know, um, it only has a ramp. That's not going to work. I see the district manager wrote back. He said, no, it has a ramp and a lift gate. So when he said that, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. like, okay, this going to work. Yeah, because before we was just saying emails talking about reservation is booked, but we didn't book no reservation. So, um, you know, he called to see what was going on. And yeah, you know, I guess they ended up booking it for us because they found out it had a lift gate and it was a 2022. Um, Cause like he said, at first we didn't have no information about it. And we finally got the information about it. We went to go check it out yesterday night before they closed and you know, everything checked out. It was exactly what we expected. So now today is pickup day and we're about to go get it. Yeah, we're about to go pull up. So. You know, like I said, you know, after that situation, we got the email. Um, well, what really happened next was he ended up, I ended up, they, so when he said they got a rep, I still didn't respond. So then the next day, did he call me? I can't remember if he called me or not. But the, the, the local, uh, the local place called me. They called me. They said, hey, we got a truck. I'm like, okay, what's the year? He still really didn't sound like, I'm thinking he just gonna go outside and go look at the truck, but he didn't do that. He's going through like some paperwork or something. I don't know what he was doing, but he said, oh, it has 100,000 or 11,000. I don't know what he was saying. And I'm like, okay, that, that must be like, you know, 2021 or something. Then after a while, he's like, no, 22, 2022, I know it's brand new. So I'm like, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna come check it out. So, so you know, I was, I told him I'd come check it out tomorrow. But we ended up going that day. Like she said, we went going that day, checked it out. We was like, okay, wait a minute. This is, this is actually 2022. Okay, we need this. So that's pretty much what happened. You know, like she said, we checked it out. And then we told them we'll come get it tomorrow, which is today. And so that's what we're doing. We're a couple turns away. And, um, you know, we, we actually got one that's outside the house right now. So that brings us to, to, to two empty. And then um, we have a driver that's located in Arizona. I believe he's in Phoenix. So we have, a, he's supposed to be getting his DOT physical today. 
Um, if he gets his DLT physical and everything goes good how it's supposed to go, then, you know, we'll go ahead and, you know, uh, do the interview process. Of course, it's going to be extensive because, yeah, he's dry. good drivers is hard to find, for real. And, um, you know, so that's going to be the process. I mean, hopefully everything works out with him and we'll put him in one of these trucks. And then the empty truck um, next week. She should be wrapping up her D, uh, DLT. She should be wrapping up her uh, CDL class, and then we'll take the other truck and we'll hit the road. You know, and we'll do it like that. Or, you know, maybe we'll get another truck to somebody else. We haven't decided yet. Any good drivers out there, man? Send me an email with your resume. You must have five. Years, really, you must have a clean MVR, five years plus clean MVR. Um, if you got a CDL, I'll give you an extra hundred on your salary starting off. Uh, it is weekly pay, um, so you know. See, see, if you're serious, I need somebody serious. I mean, because obviously you would even have to fly to me, and I only want people that's trying to start their own company. So if you're trying to start your own company, you're serious about driving, and you know you you trying to make some stuff happen, then you know let's do it, man. Let's 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 get together. I would love to get someone else a, a opportunity. I was against you know hiring people from YouTube. But one of our best drivers, actually our best driver, I'll just go ahead and you know, tip my hat to him. Our best driver, uh, we hired him from YouTube. He got our course and, you know, so on and so forth. So if you have my course, if you're trying to start your own company, come join the program, man. It's a great program. I'll have you set up to where you got your own company within, I think it's, I think it's only been a month for this guy, actually. Yeah. He's already got his LLC and everything. So if you're trying to start your own company, you're trying to work with me for a little bit while getting that experience, come to death row. Um, yeah, and if, if y'all serious, be willing to not be home for a long time. Cause I mean, there's good drivers, but a lot of them get homesick. But I mean, like- We don't want know, no cry babies, man. You know, it's a, it ain't nothing if you're trying to get to a bag, so. You trying to get to a bag, you trying to start your own company, you trying to see what it's like to be over the road three to six weeks at a time, come to death row. Right. right. So we just getting, we just pulling up, y'all. Pulling up over there. All right, we're going to uh, flip the camera. Y'all know we can't flip, flip it. Right. We're going to flip the camera and get y'all some footage, right? Right. So let's flip it and we'll be right back. All right. Hey, don't be talking smack about these clips in my head either. I'm getting my hair done so I can look good for you. Hey, you ain't gonna hold the door me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you were coming in. It's cool, like, it's cool, it's all right, it's all right. <laughs> anyway, y'all, he gonna be messed up. He over here uh, closing the door on me. But uh, let's walk back here to this truck. Y'all see it? Brand new 22 budget box truck. I think the door is locked, but we could go take a look at the back. I need y'all to see the back because the back is clean. Y'all see that? Look at the tires, though. Y'all see them tires? Brand new tires, though. Everything brand new. All right. Let's, let's show y'all the back real quick. that brand new box everything new and y'all in our old in our 2015 when we first started y'all probably didn't get to see the back but the inside the wood was hanging all on the ground and everything but look at that brand new small like wood back here everything new nothing been touched or anything okay i can't show y'all the inside though but Y'all see it? There's no type of damage on this mud. No damage. Let me see if the door open. It's probably locked though. Hubby went on the inside to get the keys. So yeah, when he come out here, I'll show y'all. Ooh, that scared me. But yeah, y'all everything brand new. All the DOT tape on there. <laughs> Not the DOT. But yeah, everything good, y'all. Everything good, brand new. 
Can't wait to show y'all the inside though. It's real, real, real clean. Everything. Y'all see it, no damage. But yeah. Let's go ahead and look at the front real quick. Take a look at the front. You know, it's a few bugs on there because I had a driver down here, but brand new Freightliner, man. Brand new. All right, let's go back here and close the back. Let's close the back. The dude looking at me all crazy, like, why is she recording? <laughs> but yeah, y'all see that? Everything new. Like, I just be, I don't know, I just get happy. I get happy when I see these trucks now. I'm like, where was this when I started, huh? But all right, y'all, I'm about to close this door and I'm gonna show y'all the inside when he get the keys. 